In today's video, I'm going to show you this really awesome and really quick way to open your video with black cinematic bars. So let's get right into it. So once you're inside of Adobe Premiere Pro and you have some footage inside of a sequence, we can begin by creating a brand new black video. So we'll go into the new item tab and we'll select black video. We'll press OK on this menu and we'll drag the black video onto video layer 2 with your footage sitting on video layer 1. Now from here we want to copy and paste this layer, so hold option on your keyboard and drag the black video up onto video layer 3. But if this doesn't work then just copy and paste the black video and drag the pasted black video up onto video layer 3. Now from here you want to select both of those black videos, go into effects, search for crop and we'll drop the crop on top of both of those black videos. Now from here we'll go onto video layer 3 so that's the top black video and we'll change the crop value of the top to 50%. Then we'll go down to video layer 2, that's the bottom black video, and we'll increase the crop value on the bottom by 50%. Now from here you want to find a point where you want the animation to begin, create a brand new keyframe on the bottom, and then go up to video layer 3, create a brand new keyframe on the top. We'll move the playhead maybe a second or two into the video, and we'll pull the value of the crop on the top up to 100% on video layer 3. We'll go down to video layer 2 and pull the crop value on the bottom to 100%. And if we play this back, you can see that this effect is now complete. But if you want to slow this down, then all you have to do is just pull the second keyframe over to the right. Just make sure that the positioning of the second keyframe match up between both black videos. Doing so will ensure that these two animate at the exact same time. Because if one of these keyframes is out of time with the other one, then the top or the bottom black bar might animate a little bit quicker than the other one. So as you can see, the top has finished before the bottom. A more extreme example would be this. The top's finished and we're still waiting for the bottom bar to finish. So make sure you match up the position of the second keyframe on the top black video and the bottom black video. And there you go. That is how you do the opening video transition effect right inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. And there you go. If you enjoyed watching this video, then please do let me know in that comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe, check out the previous video, and I will see you tomorrow for another brand new video. Thank you for watching.